All right, I wanted to do a quick video here uh, with my top three tips for reading 100 books in one year, which is something I have actually done, right? Uh, those three tips are adaptation, choosing wisely, and immersion. First one, adaptation. And this really means two things. This refers to the adapting your reading to the time that you have, okay? So you're not necessarily trying to carve out or set aside one extra hour a day just for reading. What you're trying to do is saying, okay, I'm waiting in line at the bank for 10 minutes. I've got my book with me. I can hold it, take it out and read it instead of playing a game or something, right? Um, this also means adapting to the, the format, adapting the format that you're reading to your life, okay? Um, when I went through this exercise of reading 100 books in a year, I, um, I tried audiobooks for the first time. And, it, and after, you know, it took some getting used to. I had to kind of train myself, my brain, to, to retain the books. Um, but after going through two or three books, man, I really got into it. And, and audiobooks just work really well for me. Uh, okay? But part of that, also with that, is you know, book selection and recognizing that certain books just work better for um, certain mediums, okay? Now, my story with this was actually reading Black Swan by Nicholas Taleb, and I had been gifted that book by somebody in paperback form, and I could never get through the first chapter. Something about Taleb's writing style um, was just really hard for me to get into, you know, reading it. But... I would find later with audiobooks um, that it was very natural for me to listen to and retain and remember the information via audiobook. Uh, and if you are like me, you might have better luck with um, biographies and nonfiction books in general uh, and topics that you know might touch on an area that you're already familiar with, with your career or a hobby, but then kind of tangentially spread out into some other areas that help you to, you know, learn more about the world rather than just staying in, you know, your niche that you're already established in. My third tip for you, immersion. Um, I find it's really important. Stick with one book at a time. Reading multiple books at the same time is a recipe for not finishing all of them, if you're anything like me. Okay, to review, how I read 100 books in one year. Uh, first was by adapting the my my time schedule, you know, when I read. Also adapting how I read, right? The medium. So I suggest tr trying audiobooks or ebooks or whatever to see what you can fit into your schedule. Book selection also um, is important, especially if you're trying new mediums. And then immersion. Only reading one book at a time um, is, I feel, the best way to do this. 